Okay, so hi guys, welcome to the tutorial crew for a Titan of a Job. Um, my name's Connor and I'm part of the Black Hatchet Chimp Gang. So basically we're just going to start, obviously, you're going to want to go jump in the car. We need to set the marker. So this is actually one of my favourite missions on GTA Online. Um, it's really good, you get some decent XP from it, you get some some good money from it as well. And it, it's you know it's fairly easy to do. Um, basically we're just gonna walk you through it. Man, what are you doing? Fucking driving like an idiot. Pep you up, bro. So yeah, anyway. Just need to let some of my anger out from these idiot drivers. So it should be a lot better. Uh, crashes into me again. Uh, it's pretty boring this part of the enemy should go drive to the airport. Uh, but it is a pretty straightforward drive, I'm sure you won't get lost on the way there. For fuck's sake. Okay, so obviously today is uh, Sunday is where we're idiots are out the road. Basically, if you get, it's sometimes pretty hard to get into the airport if you don't know how to do it properly. Um, and I'll show you the way I always go because it's just the easiest. Um, I should be left out here. Follow this round. The easiest way. Get out of the way, yes. But yeah, keep going down here. Especially there's a jump down here. Um, as long as no one jumps in the way and you're driving down, it's pretty easy to hit. There we go, straight in. Try not to roll the car. Right, so where I'm putting it right now is I head over there. That's where they are. Um, but basically, you'll see when I go in as well, there's two guys. And I just do this out of habit. Just always take them out straight away. Pepper them. jump out and basically you want to stay behind this container for a minute. Um, the guy up top there, that, right, you want to get him soon as really. And also watch out for these guys, they try and sneak around the back and get you. And uh, if you don't see them there, like, you, you, you're dead pretty quick. Oh shit, there's another one there. Uh, too many.
chat over here a lot because there are some guys over there. Um, so you can't see them at the minute. Oh, who we got? Who we got? No, no, no. Back in the container. Stay, stay here for a minute. See how we get on. Let's just blow this up for the sake of it. There's no one there anyway. Right, so basically we've got to move up now. And in a minute we will have to move this truck that's in front of the plane. There's a lot, they all hide over by this portal cap in as well. There's a lot over there. Uh, yeah, if they go down as well, then it's pretty hard to just keep waiting for them to get back up. Oh, come on, right, he's done. So, I know there's some people outside, but there's some also people around here. Let's get the ones outside. There he is, dead. See you later, mate. Lorry, quick, clear out a few more. Yeah, that's good. Go around him, around here. Take him out. I've lost yeah, on the shit down. Right, let's get this motherfucker in here as well. Where is he? Where is he? Let's get him that shotty. Boom. No, no. Right. So now we've cleared this out. Let's go. Let's move the lorry. We got. Oh, wait, one more. Move that out of the way. Um, you'll also notice over here as well. There's another plane. So if you're doing this mission with friends or something, um, this one here, you can. If they don't get in a Titan, they can follow you up in that plane as well. But um, the Titan is a bit faster, so it usually gets to the landing strip a lot quicker as well. So let's jump in here quick. So this is pretty, like if you've got six people in this mission, which I think is the max, you can get all six people in here, which is pretty good, um, if that's if you want to do that. So let's move out of here, alright, get some chill out music on. And basically, so on my map you can see that there's a car driving in, so basically we want to get out of there quick time, because you get that first car comes in, it's got two merry weapon mercenaries in it. But if you just fight them off, then you still got to deal with another eight coming in and two separate cars. So you don't want to be hanging about anything. Get out there quick. So basically now we've got to fly to, to the Sandy Shores airfield. It's a pretty boring flight, but we're going to try Battle Row and Titan and stuff. And it didn't go very well. You know what, as well, let's get a bit higher and let's try and fly upside down. Oh. Wait, that's not Okay, so also another note for all of you, all of our watchers out there. Don't try and fly something upside down, because it will not work. I'm sure a lot of you have been on this mission before, where you do all the hard work and you've got to do is take the plane to the airfield. Always that dickhead who 
decides to crash the map. He gets something he like jumps out or something. But yeah, so this is inside the cabin. You have one guy sitting next to you and the rest of the rest of your crew can jump in the back. But like, you can't see him. And it, your crew members can shoot out of this as well, so don't know why you don't need to shoot out the plane, but you can if you want it. Yeah, so basically when we come into this mountain, I always go straight down here, dip low into the valley, stick in the ground so we don't have a steep uh, descent when we come into the airfield. And I always like to go to the left of the marker as well, because we need to get a, a run up so, so we can get down to the runway. Um, you can see the runway now on my map. Smooth landing, is it going to be a bit bumpy? Ooh, smooth landing of course. My expert flying skills. Right, almost there. Basically make sure you don't hit your wings on anything here because a couple of times I've hit my wings and like I'm just about to take the mission. But yeah, there we go, so we parked the plane up, and we are done. Mission passed. So guys, thanks for watching our video. Um, you know, if you get stuck on anything else on this mission, or anything else, drop us a comment below. Um, yeah, and just thanks for watching, and hopefully this, this little walkthrough's got you through that part of the mission you were stuck on. And uh, don't forget to subscribe to our channel as well. Thank you.